And looking at Taylor Tape, very evenly matched, except Liam has much more experience with 87 fights to Mossop's 59. I think this gives the edge to Liam Harrison in this match. And let's send it up to Mr. Jimmy Lennon Jr. All right, fans, here we go. Glory kickboxing action in the featherweight division. Once again, we're scheduled three three-minute rounds. Presenting to you first on my right, fighting out of the blue corner, wearing silver trunks. He weighed in at 64.7 kilograms. With a record of 48 wins, seven losses, and four draws, he has 14 wins coming by way of knockout. Originally from Morocco, now fighting out of the Netherlands, please welcome the 2009 World Muay Thai Council champion, introducing Mosa. Across the ring, fighting out of the red corner on my left, wearing red trunks with gold trim. He weighed in at 64.8 kilograms. His record stands at 72 wins, 13 losses, and two draws, with 47 wins coming by way of knockout. Hailing from Leeds in England, widely recognized as the UK's top Muay Thai featherweight, here is the four time kickboxing world champion, Liam. The Hitman Harrison! A referee in charge now to give instructions, Mufadel El Ghazawi. Listen, guys, it's glory rules. No elbow, no hard work, and no cleansing, okay? Say cat, good luck. Go back. Judge! 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 Time. Well, we all smiles at the weigh-in in the press conference, but now they're really serious. Well, time. And Frank, I think we can expect what? sparks in this fight. Yeah, definitely. Most of these guys are very experienced in Muay Thai. Push kicks, round kicks. Liam has fought in Thailand quite a bit. It's very popular over there. He was one and one against Anawad, who's a really well-known Thai champion, probably a Hall of Famer for sure in Muay Thai. And uh, Mosab won a technical knockout against Anawad. But uh, Liam Harrison seemed to think it was a premature stoppage, so he didn't really respect the win. Mosab trying to tee to the leg, and they chop away at each other, but I, I don't think that... Uh, Mosab Amrani wants to get into a low kick contest here with Liam Harrison. Now Amrani, his left hand is very active. He likes to bang the body with it, so watch that setup. Yeah, a real fluid puncher coming from the outside with an uppercut that missed. And Liam counters back. But Mosab drops it with wow. oh what a shot! Man! Hit him in the bread basket. I'm telling you, he's looking this, for his this win. Fight could be over. He's looking for his win. Ho! Oh. What a win! Mosab Amrani has done it here in the first round and knocked out Liam Harrison. Wow. And that's quite an accomplishment because Liam Harrison came into this widely talked about and widely heralded as somebody who's going to shake things up. Man. Mosab jumped right on him. First, I thought it was going to be a technical battle, but Mosab said, no, nope, we're going into the trenches and bada boom, here it comes. And here it was, that uppercut from Mosa set him back, jabbed the range, bam, hooked to the body, right in the liver. Ho ho! You see it again right here, just well timed, Boop, reached over and popped it. You know, it was a delayed reaction because after he threw the hook to the to the liver, you know, Harrison fired back with a right low kick, but then he went, whoa, man. And if you've never been hit in the liver, it literally shuts your whole body down. And you can't figure out why you can't move and you can't breathe, and everything just seems tight right there. Oh. Just took the wind from it. That might have been more of a, a wind shot than a liver shot because it was kind of in the front. Yeah. Either way, though, you could see him just instantly tighten up, fall over, and he didn't get up for a minute. So let's kick it up to Jimmy Lennon for the final particulars. <laughs> 